Hey guys, OIQB here and welcome back to another unboxing. So, um, today's video is a bit special. Um, I must say thank you Jipoli for sending me the uh, Foxy loops to try them out. And in this video, I was requested to test them all and pick my four favorite loops. So, I actually never heard of Foxy loops before and there's a total of six different uh, lubricants, I guess. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, eight different set of loops. So I decided to try it out. I, I'm actually wondering what's the difference between each of the uh, colors. So I'm just, just gonna arrange them according to rainbow color. Actually, the box is nice. So yeah, there's a total eight different uh, lubricants. Is it gonna be work similar to the uh, like the speed cube shop ones? I don't really know. So. I have a lot of cubes uh, besides me, so here is the Qi MS 3x3, I really set up this cube, we'll do a review pretty soon, so let's just get into the red one shall we, so I'm just gonna open up the loops, okay, um, yeah, I'm wondering what's the differences in between them, so I'm just gonna take a puzzles <coughs> and put some on the tracks or the corner base do some first things hmm it's almost work like some of the uh, factory loops like the Chi MS the uh, Dian the Wiccan, the Gen Sticky Loop, it's sort of somewhat that concept, which is something I pretty like because it definitely helps to slow down the puzzles. And I like that gummy feel. So, yeah, this is basically almost works like the heavy loops if you want to simplify that. Alright, like, so I guess the thickness will be affected from the uh, rainbow colors, I guess. Now let's just take another cube and try out the orange. Whoa. Whoops. So this is the orange ones. Let's do some first tens. Um, I didn't actually feel felt any difference comparing to red, but somehow, wait, let me just try to solve it more. Yeah, it's definitely a bit faster. And it breaks in a lot faster too, so... Hmm, about the same thing to the red, maybe a little bit faster. Alright, next up we have this cube. Now we're going to try out the yellow ones. So 
just go ahead and break in the cube. Okay, it's also probably the same thing. Yeah, it's almost the same thing to be honest. Yeah, it's probably almost the same thing to other colors. I'm just wondering, are they the same or there's just a difference? Colors of center caps. I don't really know. I just use this one. Still a lot of loops in there. No, this is the green ones. Okay, this one is the one that I start to feel a little bit different now. It's like um, the silicone basis of these loops, but it also helps to speed up the puzzle. Yeah, it's something that's great when your puzzle is probably like overlooped and you want also a plush to feel with it. Maybe this green one might be suitable. So far, this is what I got by testing according to cubes. Not bad actually. Hmm. Now let's try out the cubes. And lubricant as well. Jesus, there's a lot of lube in here. Not sure. So far I'm trying, I, I don't really notice any difference between lubes because they are just all the same type of it. Now let's see what's the difference in blue. Okay, it's definitely a lot faster. Similar to this one, I guess, but this one is much more like it catch up the speed much faster. Hmm, interesting. It's almost similar to what both of the uh, colors, like these two are almost the same. This is a little bit different, and these two are almost the same. That's weird, actually. Let's try out some other cubes as well. Right. Now this is the uh, purple ones. Okay, okay. My puzzle just immediately becomes unstable. Okay, it's <laughs> really fast. So it is said that it's a much faster version of these two, so Yeah, because this cube starts to feel a bit unstable now. Before our lubricant is much more controllable, but right now it's just wow, really, really un start to feel unstable. So I would say uh, these two loops are almost the same. This one's a bit faster. This one's a much faster compared to this, and this one is even faster. So I'm just gonna arrange them. Let's just continue the process of testing it. Maybe, maybe you know not this cube. Oh, there's a lot of loops in there. Never mind, I don't really care. This is actually the uh, regular RS3M, by the way. I haven't gotten the uh, RS3M 2020 versions, but we'll get it soon in my hand. 
so far I always put these lubricants on the uh, corner bases because I want to see how it reacts in the corner base so and it's the uh, the best way I decided to test it to give myself more information about each of these loops Okay, <laughs> this puzzle is damn fast Almost similar to this one to be honest Whoops That's actually really fast. It just because this cube has a lot of sluggish in it, and it's just pretty much removed it. Okay, this is really really fast. Like comparing to this purple ones, it's definitely a lot faster. I mean, yeah. Maybe about the same. I don't really know. And, uh, yeah, let's just grab this cube here. And let's try the last lubricant, which is the black ones. Jipoli might sold it one day, so I was requested to be a tester and to send, uh, their sense about uh, the comments and response about these lubricants and see how I feel of them. So far, I would say... It some of the according to rainbow colors, some of them are fast, some of them are slow. In a silicone, not really a silicone, but more of a uh, how do I say? It's not watery also, but in a silky way. Not pretty sure. Whoops! It's just the first sense. Holy cow! This is fast. Holy cow! Okay, this cube is. Damn, it's unstable. So starting from the lubricants like over here, it's more of a faster lubricants. Man, my Thunderclap V3 was really stable, but after applying this, it just becomes really, really unstable. Hmm, okay. So, so far as a testing other than, I would say that in between these are the faster lubricants. These are more of a uh, middle ones. This is the middle in between these tubes. And these ones are just the slower loops. Now, if you want me to pick four of my favorites, um, I would say, of course, I'll pick these two because, to be honest with you guys, I do really like slower ones. <coughs> Excuse me. And then we have, and I'm just gonna pick one, this one as well, and uh, this one as well, because I'm I picked these two reasons because these two are the ones that are usually like my usual style of lubricating cubes. These ones just just um, help to be get a bit faster, and these are just because if the cube just get way too like gummy or whatsoever, and I want to keep want to speed up the puzzle while keeping the silky smooth feel I will add with this loop so these are my four favorites which is red orange yellow and blue but according to my arrangements somewhat like this these are just more of the slower ones these are just middle in between these two these are just the middle ones where you will usually see how fast those uh, factory loops so, so it's almost react to the same like the Chi Emma loops uh, the S1 loops somewhat like that, but S1 loops has a silky smooth way of this one So it's a bit different and starting from these here is just the faster loops And this is the crazy fast and these fast are still somewhat controllable Maybe like this actually, but yeah So this is the testing video about uh, the foxy loops. Thank you Jpoli so much for sending these loops to me to try it out now Jibbly haven't really sold this on, so be sure to stay tuned for that. Make sure to use the discount code OYCUBE1011 to get 5% off from your order at Jibbly websites when you purchase the queue from there. And yeah, nothing to say about uh, these loops. They are actually pretty great, and according to Rainbow Colors, it definitely uh, obviously notice its speed. And yeah. Make sure to give a like and subscribe to my channel. Hope you guys enjoyed this uh, testing video and I'll see you guys next time.
Bye. Falling faster than they said. 